I simply need to take this in from what I've done today. That's the greatest accomplishment. And it's just the third day I'm here today. This week I climbed to the top of the mountain energy. I want to thank everybody who made this possible. And we're going to fuck shit up this year. Excuse me for my language, but this is beautiful. I want to make the Olympic trials this year. And I want to do something great because I want to inspire people. For the past year, maybe, I don't know, 10 years I've been running, 12 years up this mountain since I was a kid. Just never been up here. I've hiked here once, but it's different. Running's different. I've gotten up here today for the first time running. I remember I got got close here one time and I never made it back home. I didn't stop for water, but it's always important to stop for water. But this is, today is July 21st, I believe. And it's Monday. 2015, I'm delirious. The altitude is burning my lungs right now. I'm over 3,500 feet. And this is where it all begins. My professional running career from the top of this mountain. I've reached the top of this mountain. I've def This year I've definitely inspired many people. Third place at the NCAA National Championship and fifth for the 5k and fifth place in the 10k from what I came from last year at Sicily to what I said what I was gonna do I was gonna fuck shit up and so I did but now we're looking out to the horizon and the blue the blue is amazing you see it's there's a lot more distance I could see because now I can see further and I can see further into my future now I know where I want to go I want to hit those Olympic trials I want to become a professional runner and hopefully in four years, we're going to have to find a bigger mountain. It'll be Mount Etna, 10,000 feet, twice as high. And that'll make the Olympic team in 2020. That's when I'll make the Olympics. There's nobody up here. But that's my goal. Once you all reach your goal, just freaking find it. Because I was the weakest kid in high school. I was, the, in elementary school, I was a weak, wimpy kid. I barely had any endurance. Now I'm hitting almost 200 miles a week. I'm dehydrated, dead up here. I gotta head down soon, but. Where you could do anything, I'm telling you. My legs aren't as crooked as when I was when I was a kid. I was born with a crooked leg or somewhat. And that was fixed by lifting weights. And. I lifted weights like. You know, just little things improve. Qu core strength. You know, I'm going to do some videos on that. <laughs> Back down on the farm, I'll just lift some things. But you'll make it here. I swear to God, anybody could because everybody was faster than me. Everybody was better than me. Everybody. I'm not kidding. And there's nobody up here. And now there's nobody up here. Now there's nobody around. And I want somebody to come join me because I'm lonely at times. But I climb this mountain every day and I want to become a legend. Everybody in this town knows me. All the farm people, all the country people out here, they all know who I am. They always talk to me when I'm down there. I don't see them up here ever, but I've become somebody. I just became this running guru, <laughs> I would say. And that's what I wanted to do in my life because I just reached out for it. It is incredible this altitude this height this is why i want to end my story for the rest of this whole entire summer please follow me guys having subscribers having almost 150 followers this year has been amazing i know it's not a thousand i know it's not a million but whatever if i can inspire one person i did my goal if i could inspire 10 people i did a little bit of i could inspire 150 people that's all i could ask for because Man, I don't even I can't talk to a hundred people every day. That's a lot of that's a lot of Facebook messaging. But if I can inspire one person a day, maybe. If I can inspire one person a day, it'll be the most beautiful thing in my life. Maybe when I'm reincarnated, I'll do this again. 
I'll become human again and I'll start earlier in life and I'll do it again and I'll do it again. Maybe I'll be a bird, an eagle, and I'll live out here and I'll just fly. That would be an amazing second life, but I want the most beautiful things in life. F fruitful fruit, sweet and free. Not burnt, fried, smothered in oil. That's the way I eat. I eat fruit. It's the sweet things in life. The good things in life are always sweet. Veganism, fruitarianism, whatever you call it, this is for veganism. This is for every animal that die. I climb this mountain. This is for every person. I climb this mountain. I, cl I climb this mountain for respect for everything, for everything in this life, for every soul. For veganism, for every animal that's been slaughtered, I climb this mountain. I climb this mountain. for everything in life. And that's why I'm here to inspire you guys, always inspiring everything, every living soul, right here on the El Coyote Local Show. Peace out.